Hey YouTube, what's up? It's me again for the third time today, my third video for the day. And this is a what's up, what, blah, blah, what's in your makeup bag tag. And this is requested once again by Fat Faces 73, and that's fat with a P. So let me go ahead and get started because as you can see, it's getting kind of dark outside. And yeah, you're not going to be able to see me because the lighting in my room sucks. So let's just do this. Okay, first, let me just go through this. I have my Maybelline XXL Extensions Mascara. Um, this is one of my favorite mascaras, definitely. And, um, like, I still want to try more, but this is up there, like, top three, at least. So, try that, ladies. And this is my e.l.f. powder brush. And this was recommended to me by one of my best friends. And I will make sure I link, uh her page down there somewhere and uh, her name is Miss Princess Jazz 091 I think that's it sorry Jazz if I don't remember your YouTube name um I always get it confused with your Twitter name I don't know if I should have said that oops okay so yeah um this is awesome for putting on foundation or powder it works good for both I love it thanks Jazz and this is my little powder brush. I think I got it from Walmart. Don't really like it because it's kind of hard, but I haven't gotten around to buying a new one. Okay, so that's that. And then right now I'm using this powder. I don't wear foundation, liquid foundation every day. So when I don't wear liquid foundation, I just use my L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Powder. And this is in N7. So this is what it looks like. Um, I've already hit pan on it. I wouldn't consider buying this again because I don't like the way it smells. Sorry, but I'm not going to waste my money and throw it away. My ultimate favorite foundation, which is the Revlon Color Stay. And this is in 400 Caramel or Caramel, however you guys want to say it. This stuff is awesome. I heard it's better than the MAC Studio Fix Fluid. And I just love this stuff. And, I mean, if I could wear it every day, I would. But I, I just, I'm too lazy to get up in the morning and put on liquid foundation. Sorry. Okay, and then this is my Maybelline Line Stiletto Liquid Liner. Love this stuff. I will continue to buy it, definitely. I don't, I stopped carrying a lot of eyeshadow because it was just getting ridiculous. I'm just being honest. Um, so right now I'm carrying my Wet n Wild uh, 3 palette color icon. And this is in Walking on Eggshells. I carry this one because it's like uh, everyday basic colors. Neutral eye, but it still has a little bit of shimmer to it. And this is what it looks like. Okay, so that's that. And then, um, this is one of my new favorite nude lipsticks because I've just been into nude lipsticks lately. And this is by L'Oreal. And this is from their Color Reach line. And this is an 800 Ferris Nude. And I know this, I know it's backwards on my camera. It's because I'm using my webcam. And this is what it looks like. I'm going to put a little on, actually. Yeah. So, that's that. Okay. And I have my L'Oreal Hip, um, what is this called? Shine Struck Liquid Lip Color Lip Gloss. And this is an 866 Reserve. I love this stuff. It's not sticky at all. It's real nice. And I have my NYC Lip Shine. And this is in New, New York or something. Love this stuff too. Then also I have two lip liners. This is one, one of them is my NYC Lip Liner in Naughty Nude. It's like the same exact color as my lips. And then this one is my Rimmel Lasting Finish 1000 Kisses um, and Spice. That's right, one of my favorites. <laughs> okay, and then also right now I'm using the Rimmel London Soft Coal Eyeliner. Don't really like it. I so miss my um, my Pixie one. I actually have my Pixie one. I don't know why I'm holding on to it, but probably because it was a great eyeliner. <laughs> May she rest in peace. And this is what she looks like. Now, so I have to go out and spend another $15 on one of these because it was amazing, as you can see. Okay, then I have my Wet n Wild Heather Silk, and this is just the color icon blush. This is what it looks like. I don't have it on right now, but I love this. It's very pigmented, so you don't use a lot. Then I have my um, NYC Blushable Cream Stick. I'm pretty sure you guys saw most of this stuff in one of my videos, but it's all good. This is what it looks like. I don't have any on. I don't have on any blush today, but I love this thing. It gives you a really dewy finish. It's just great overall. 
Then I have my oh, my heart candy glamouflage. This is the okay. Let me tell you, it covers up anything and everything. So I love it, and it was only like five or six dollars at Walmart. This is heart candy, by the way, I think I said that. And this is my Elf lip primer and plumper. Um, this is a primer side. And this is just like for people who have darker pigmented lips and they have a bright lipstick and they really want it to pop. So, yeah. And um, this was the plump inside, but I broke it. So, it's just, I don't know, it's nothing now. Um, oh, yeah. I also have my NYC, uh, I don't remember the name of this, but it's like moisturizing lipstick or something like that. And this is in retro red. You know what? I think I'll put some of this on to match my earrings, so it might look like crap because I don't have a liner. Mm. Wow. I forgot how good this stuff was. But yeah, that's that. And I got it actually to do my pin up look. Be looking out for that. I keep forgetting to do it. So we'll be looking out for it. It's coming soon. Then I got my NYX um, Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. You know, everybody has this. But I have it too now. Just got it like a week ago. And my favorite primer for my shadow. And this is by e.l.f. And it's, uh, what is it? Just eye primer and lid sealer. This is, I only use a primer side, but this is what it looks like. And this is the lid primer stuff. You just dip this. I mean, not the lid primer, the lid line sealer. Okay, you just dip this in your favorite uh, eyeshadow, and then you can use it as a liquid eyeliner. It's great, but I don't use it a lot because I like to wear black. Black liner. Okay. Then, <laughs> oh my gosh, my makeup bag is a mess. I have a lighter. I don't smoke, guys. I don't. Okay, this is for my little baby um, pixie eye eye pencil whatever but it's because like I lost the lid to it so it kept drying out so the only way to get it working again was with the lighter so next time I'll make sure I don't break the lid and I have a few little hair clips you never know when you need those and I have a blender sponge I'm missing stuff one second guys okay um so yeah I knew I was messing stuff. I just probably because I just put it on. But this is my L'Oreal Studio Secrets uh, Magic Perfecting Base. This stuff is great too, but it was like $10 and I really don't think it was worth it. So I probably won't be buying this again. Even though it's great, I think I could find better for cheaper. Like maybe I'll try the hard candy again. Then I have my little elf eyelash curler. And then I have my favorite brow uh, liner, brow, brow pencil, sorry. And this is Maybelline Define a Brow. This stuff works great. Sorry guys, just checking out my lips. So yeah. Oh, and sorry mom, I stole your makeup bag. But this is what it looks like. The Ralph Lauren. And you don't want to see the inside. It's dirty. So that's pretty much it. Even though I don't carry my makeup bag around. I carry it like when I have to travel to my grandma's house, to my mom's house, places like that. And that's just the basic stuff that I take. Um, so, uh, thank you for watching. If you have any uh, requests, just let me know and I will surely be able to do them now. Now that, you know, my spring semester is over, even though I'm in summer school, I do have a little bit more time on my hands. So, make sure you guys comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Bye.